Ah, Vanellope's, the sweet treat shop that's contained on the Disney Dream that's an extra charge. What a wonderful place to go into and look around and some wonderful treats that you can get. Well, in this video, we're going to talk about that. We're going to show you around Vanellope's and we're also going to show you a treat that we ordered specifically at Vanellope's and had delivered to our table. More on that as we go through the video. Okay, so here we are walking into Vanellope's. This is from the side where you are inside of Cabana's versus the other door that's outside on the pool deck. And we're gonna walk around and look at many of these treats. You can see that it's Halloween on the high seas cruise that we're on right here. And there are these various treats and you can see the prices below those various treat items as we're going along here. Now, do you really need to get these treats? No, but it's something special, something cool, something you may want to give someone or might want to have as an adult or as kids to have as a special treat on any given time. Just know there's plenty of other food, plenty of other treats on uh, the Disney Dream that you do not have to really worry about. Now, here's one thing, those chocolate-covered strawberries. I know my wife would love to get those somewhere else. We used to get them in Palo can't get them now that's the only place you really can get them consistently here now here we are walking a little bit further around many of the other treats as well and you can see various cupcakes and many of these you can actually get delivered to your room it's part of the things you can purchase before the cruise here you see various cookies various other specialty treats that you could get during this Halloween on the high seas cruise those macarons that I'm sure are, are beautiful. Uh, to me, they're always beautiful, but they're never as yummy as they look. They're just pretty types of, of little cookies. Maybe that's just my opinion. Here we are looking at the various items up above that are also going to be down below, but you can see the various prices on those. Uh, the cool cookie there for this specific ship. As we're walking a little further down, you can see all of the little things you can put in or add-ins to when you're doing ice cream and sundaes and things like that. Uh, something that we will speak to here in a moment when we're going to speak to these two items. Uh, these two items are pretty cool. You can get them here in the restaurant. We got ours actually delivered to our table. And we're going to get into that in a little bit. We're going to show you the, the board that talks about the prices and all of that. Now, this is a little, as you can see, cloudy there because it's the gelato and the ice cream that you can get. You are free to come in and get this. Now, for me, if I was just going to come in and get this, probably not. Because I'll go right around the corner and get me some of that wonderful banana and strawberry if they have it that day. Or the vanilla or the chocolate. Or go grab a cup, get the vanilla ice cream in there, and then add the Coke to it or something to make a Coke float. Here's another, uh, you know, really look at some of the other gelatos that they have here in Vanellope's. A wonderful selection, a really cool thing to just come in and look around to see everything that they have. Even if you're not going to get any of this, this is something that's a really uh, cool place to walk around. Now, as you can see right here, that's Vanellope uh, hanging from the ceiling. It goes with the theming of Wreck-It Ralph. And you can see that in the Candy Land or the, the game that they play actually in the movie. Over here is the car and all of that. It's an amazing setup here in Vanellope's. Many of the Disney cruise ships have something similar to this. Uh, but to me, this is really, really cool, especially if you love the movie Wreck-It Ralph or, or, or those types of, of items. There you can see the door from the outside people walking from the pool deck into cabanas here you can see all of the various products that you can get here in Vanellope's uh, again with the theming they're trying to make it seem like a cool candy shop and it is but all the popcorn all the candies all of those various items that you can get on almost any ship but you can see here there's a little street in the middle uh, there's all of these various popcorns and candies. Do I, would I generally spend the money on that? No. Uh, but if you're here and you want a special treat, you know, feel free to come in and get one of those. If you want one of those big lollipops or your kid does, hey, perfect timing to come in here and get those items. 
Another thing I wanted to note in here, there were some sounds and some cool things in the background. I was like, what in the world is that? It's Some of these machines actually would talk to you as you walked along. Uh, these are the uh, gumball looking machines that are made to look like a gas pump. Below them are just some of the various treats that you can get here in Vanellope's. Again, cool spot to walk around, lots of cool things to see, lots of very cool theming to the movie. But is it something you must get? No. But I must say, walk in here at least. Walk in and see what's there. You don't have to buy a thing here in Vanellope's. Now, like I said, there's a couple of specialty things that you can purchase here on the ship. You can get them and eat them uh, right outside, or you can get them delivered to your table. It's also my understanding you probably can get the Sunday portion of it and what they put in it in a separate bowl, and then have this other item that you can take home, because what you're going to get is that little car, and that's what we got. We got the, the little car, and what is contained in that little car are the various items that we're going to speak to in a second but we have ours here at home uh, we also got one for our in-laws it was a special occasion so it was a very cool thing for us to get in this specific circumstance now right here you can see the various sundays that you can get here in vanellope's uh, the ralph's uh, family challenge that was the big thing that looked like a big winner's cup and then there's the Vanellope's Go-Kart Sunday, King Candy, Hero's Duty, uh, some of these other things. You can see the individual gelato, ice cream, and milkshake prices. You know, it's not inexpensive, but it's something cool to get if you want. However, the one thing we got was actually the Vanellope's Go-Kart Sunday. You can see here that it included three scoops of vanilla ice cream, five toppings, whipped cream, and a cherry. It's served in a take-home souvenir go-kart. And we're into cars. We love cars. Uh, we love the Cars movie, but we also loved uh, Wreck-It Ralph. But for this special occasion, it was my in-law's anniversary, and we decided let's get this, let's surprise them at the table, which was kind of interesting in that when you do that, uh, they'll come around and try to get a dessert order from you and we were saying no no we don't need to do that and you can tell that my in-laws were like really i don't get this i don't get to choose a dessert tonight well it's because we had gone down earlier in the day made the decision to get this and we were having it delivered to the table so what we're going to show you next is actually the uh, the video of them delivering it to the table So here we are waiting, that's my mother-in-law and father-in-law, and we could see the lady come in from the Vanellope's restaurant carrying those in the background. And luckily, thankfully, the dessert finally showed up. When it showed up, they kind of, of course, had this look because they don't know what just hit them. But this is a little car, the Vanellope's car that we had ordered earlier in the day, and you can do this. You can get it ordered and brought directly to your table, which is really a cool, experience to get this as you can see it's pirate night and they don't know what to think of it well we get to eat it we get to then take it home with us they clean it up for you after you get done eating it as you can see an extremely cool thing to come to your table those around you are kind of jealous once they see this they're like how do i get that well you have to order it earlier in the day down at vanellope's So that was our experience in receiving these various Vanellope cars with all the treats contained therein. You go and you select any of the, the flavors of gelato or ice cream. You choose any of the toppings. You make it as extravagant or as simple as you want to. But it's, in my opinion, something good for that special time, that special treat, that special occasion, like somebody's. 50th anniversary or by the time we went on this cruise it was their 51st anniversary but it was a cool experience and a cool treat to get well folks we hope you enjoyed our video talking about Vanellope's talking about what you can get including the cool little car and the ice cream contained therein uh, it was actually in the car as you can see when we got into that restaurant I do know that on some of the other ships you can get uh, other things like for example 
on the uh, the one that's on the Wish, you can get a Bing Bong that supposedly has ice cream and stuff inside of them. However, you can get the actual treats in a, in a regular bowl and get that separate. So I suspect you might be able to do that as well, but part of the cool part of this was to get it delivered to your table, and that was a very cool part of this Vanellope um, really surprise that we had for our in-laws on this cruise. So we hope you enjoyed it, and until next time, happy meandering.